so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! It's me, Blippi. Ooh, what is this? Huh? This is a tank, and today we're going to fill it up with water. Go around the park, find items to see if they'll either sink or float. But first, we need water. <laughs> Good thing I have a bunch of water. Let's fill it up. One. Two. Three. This looks like the perfect amount of water. Now, let's go to the park, find items, so then we can see if they'll either sink or float. Let's go! Okay, now let's find some items at the playground, and so then we can see if they'll sink or float. <laughs> Come on! Whoa, look at this! How convenient! It's a tote. Whoa! So then we can put all the items in here. Let's go! Whoa! A rock wall! See? You climb up it. Whoa, whoa! Oh! And look at what it is! Whoa! Look! Some toys! Blue and orange! Okay, watch me climb up the rock wall. Red slide! Whoa! Look at the bottom! Whoa! Look! Whoa! Yeah! Look at what we found! Two more items! These are oranges! Yum! I love oranges! And they're the color orange! <laughs> okay, let's go! I found another item. Do you see it? Yeah, see? Right here. This is a dumbbell. Urgh. Makes really big muscles. Yeah. Urgh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I wonder if it'll sink or float. It's pretty heavy. Put it in there. Let's go. Come on. Another slide! Look! This is the same color as the last side. It's big and red. Whoa! Look! Yum! Some chips! <laughs> I wonder if these will sink or float. Let's put it in the tote so we can go see. Wow! Look at this area! Whoa, go the other way. Whoa, hello! <laughs> oh, look, another item. Whoa, it's a dog bone. What's this doing on the playset? Hmm, it's the color green. I wonder if this will sink or float. Put it in there so we can go find out. Whoa, wow, the color green. And then also, 
blue! Oh, oh hey, some stairs! Oh, hey! I'm so high up here! Whoa! Whoa! Oh, look over there! A big red slide. Okay, I'll go down. Okay, here I come! Whoa! <laughs> that was awesome! Oh, hey! Look at what we found! Four yo-yos! One is the color green. This one is the color orange. This one is the color blue. And this one is the color red. Let's go see what else we can find. Come over here. What is this? Looks like a steering wheel. Whoa! Whoa! I am so dizzy. <laughs> okay, let's go see what else we can find. Woo, look at this. Looks like a staircase. Hello. <laughs> Ooh, another slide. Yeah, and it's the color red. All right, here I come. <laughs> Do you see what I see? Yeah, another item. And these are colored pencils. Whoa, there's so many colors in there. Wow. Okay, let's put it in the tote so we can see if they'll sink or float. Come on. Couple more items, then the tote will be nice and full. Come on. Oh, do you see what I see? <laughs> Look. Wow. This is a magnifying glass. Watch this. Whoa. Wow. Hello. Whoa. <laughs> ah. Woo! <laughs> you can see things nice and close. Whoa! Is that an ant? Whoa! A little flea. <laughs> so many cool insects. Okay, let's put this in the tote so we can see if it'll sink or float. Woo! What's over here? Whoa! Whoa! A bridge. Be careful on this. Come on. Watch out. <laughs> Ooh, look at these. Oh, cute little toys. Hey, hello. <laughs> One, two, three. <laughs> wow, so many cool things. Oh, even more. Ooh. Bright yellow golf balls. One, two, three. Yeah, three golf balls. Okay, here I go. Another slide. Oh, whoa. There's another item down here. Ooh, glow sticks. I'm excited to see if those will sink or float. All right, this looks like a full tote of items. Let's go see if they'll sink or float. <laughs> Ooh, awesome. All right, now that we have all of these items, now we can put them in the tank and see if they'll sink or float. All right, let's see, what do we have here? Ooh, a magnifying glass. Ooh. <laughs> All right. I wonder if this will sink or float. I think I know. Ready? Yeah. It went to the bottom. So that means it sinks. All right. What else do we have here? Oh, hey. 
orange and blue yo-yos. All right, let's put them in. Yep, they float. All right, wow. So magnifying glass that's really heavy sinks and then the really light things that are full of air, the yo-yos, float. All right, let's see. Ooh, bright yellow golf balls. Hmm. <laughs> Ooh, all right, let's see if these golf balls sink or float. Oh, look, a yo-yo went to the bottom. So now the yo-yo sinks. <laughs> all right, back to the golf balls, ready? Whoa, yep, golf balls sink. All right, let's see. Ooh, some chips, snacks. All right, let's see if the bag sinks or floats. Ready? Yep, it floats. But wait a second, what if we take the bag, open it up, and see if the chips inside sink or float, ready? Whoa, <laughs> all of those float as well. Let's put the bag in there too. <laughs> all right, let's see. Oh, the dog bone, that's the color green. Do you think it'll sink or float? Pretty hard, it's very dense. Ready? Whoa, it just went to the bottom real quick. So it sinks, all right. Ooh, two more yo-yos. <laughs> yep, we already knew those, those float and then eventually sink. Whoa, I bet you know it. this sinks and floats. Yeah, this is a weight. It's full of metal in there and it's really heavy. Ready? <laughs> yeah, that purple weight sinks. Ooh, look at the water. It's getting really murky because all of the, the chips are disintegrating and going in the water. All right, we better hurry before it gets too dirty to see if they sink or float. All right, these rubber toys <laughs> that are hollow. Ready? Yep, do you see? <laughs> they went to the top. They float. <laughs> all right, a couple more. Some of this orange. Uh, nice soft dough clay stuff. <laughs> it sinks. <laughs> All right, here we go. Whoa, yep, it went to the bottom. It sinks. All right, and then colored pencils. Whoa, colored pencils float. Cause they're made out of wood. And a lot of the wood around the world sink or floats, I mean. Yeah, because they're all on the top. All right, and last but not least, the neon glow sticks. Whoa. Whoa. Look at them. They're so bright. Whoa. All right, let's see if they sink or float. Yep. They sink. <laughs> all right, that's all. Well, oh. I have a special surprise for you. The magical vial. This time, whoa, it has blue powder. See, whoa. <laughs> All right, let's put the blue powder in here. Whoa. <laughs> All right, now we have to stir it. Whoa. It's making it really blue. <laughs> it's so fun to see what sinks and what floats. Wow. <laughs> this blue water is like the water you see in the Bahamas or Thailand. <laughs> Whoa. All right. Well, this is the end of this video. That was awesome doing this science experiment to see what sinks and what floats. If you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I 
P-P-I, Flippy. Good job. See you again. Bye-bye. <gasps> Whoa! Today, we are at the Florida Aquarium, and this is gonna be so much fun! Let's go! Whoa! This area, you can actually touch stingrays with two fingers, okay? Come on. I didn't quite get him. Oh, here he is. I touched him. And he's really soft. And it kind of has a little mucus type of feel. Really slippery. Oh, look at that one. Hey. Look. <laughs> it's a sea turtle. Teko, you want to dance? Whoa! Look! Hey! Whoa, look at all the fish! And did you see that stingray? Wow! There's so many tropical fish in here! Whoa, like that little guy! Okay, let's go down here. Whoa, there's hundreds of them. Look at the angelfish. Hey. Ooh, this is a black and yellow fish. Hello. Wow. Keep, keep going. They kind of look like rocks. See those? But they're actually alive. Okay. Oh, what do you do right here? Ooh, I think it's time for a picture. Did you see its tail? They have really long tails. Ooh, let's go on this side. There's a big shark. I have a better place to see all these fish at. Hurry, let's go quick. This is a really big aquarium. Oh, it's coming close. Look at that one.
different types of sea creatures under the aquarium, I got to go on top of the aquarium and do something really special. Whoa! Look at this place. We are on top of the coral reef at the Florida Aquarium. This is a little behind the scenes for you. I've never been on top of an aquarium before. Oh, look at who it is. What's your name? Oh, hi, I'm Eric, and you're Blippi. Yeah, wow. I'm Blippi. I can't believe you're visiting. Yeah, what do you do here? Oh, I'm a curator here at the Florida Aquarium. Okay. We're right on top of the coral reef, and curators take care of animals, and we can care, and it means everything from round the clock health care to, guess what? What? Feeding time! Ooh, yeah. I love food! I love food too, it's lunch time. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it is? It is, it's lunch for the sharks, it's lunch for our big turtle flip you're gonna meet, for all of the thousands of fish that are in our environment here called the Florida Coral Reef. Woohoo! Alright, I think it's time, let's go! Flippy, we're heading over to the feed station right now, and let me introduce you to Alyssa. Hello! Hi. How are you? Good, how about you? Good! So we are about to be feeding the deep side of our reef tank. Okay. We got a lot of different fish here, but we have a lot of different fish in the reef that like to eat. So right there. Take a good sniff. That's some fresh Ooh. fish there. Yeah. Yum. Yeah. <laughs> nice big mackerel. Ew. So Maybe what we'll have you do is put on some gloves. Oh, I should have done that first. <laughs> it's super simple. Take a big scoop of fish. Okay. And you're just going to throw it out into the reef. And you'll oh. see a bunch of fish swim up. All in four. here exactly. Boy. So right there we have some squid, uh -huh. we have some herring, we have clam and night smelt. Oh, the whole mix. Can I sneak a little for myself? Yeah. Lunch is <laughs> not going to come faster. <laughs> All right. Where to? Over this way. Yep. Right field. That's a sports turn. Yeah. Good job. That looks tasty. All that right. looks like some good squid and mackerel there. Yeah. Three, two, one. Hey, Blippi, you're doing a great job. Now let's go down below and see what it looks like to be a fish underwater watching all that food come down. Okay, Ready? let's go. Let's go. Alyssa, take us from here. After feeding all of the sea creatures from above the aquarium, Eric took me back down below so we could watch all of the sea creatures eat all of the food I just fed them. It was so spectacular. And then I went on over to the wetlands exhibit. Whoa! Look! A duck! It's so cute! Do you see it? Quack, 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 Can you make the sound of a duck? Quack, quack, quack! This area is where they have the otters. Look! Whoa! Look at him doing backflips! This place is so beautiful! Whoa! Whoa! A python! A python. Whoa, look how big it is! Jeez, that's scary. Come on! Ooh, some cute birds over here! These are spoonbills. And they're white and pink! Look, he's looking for food! Fish are so big. Whoa, get really close. Can you see it? Oh, 
such a big fish. And here's some more fish. Go up really close to the glass. <laughs> Let's see what else they have here. I had such a great time at the Florida Aquarium. Next time you're in Tampa, Florida, you can go check out some sea life. Hey, hey, hey. Come here. hey, it's me, Flippy, and today we're at Odyssey in Scottsdale, Arizona. This is gonna be awesome. I think today you and I should learn about some animals. Whoa, look at this place. Whoa, those are kind of like raindrops. Hello. Okay, let's go over here. Whoa, we're almost to the top. It's gonna be so much fun! Oh, did you see that? I just used two fingers on the back of the head and the back of this Russian sturgeon. Oh, it looks like he liked it. Whoa, it feels so cool. It's hard but also has kind of a layer of a slippery sludge on it. <laughs> it helps keep all the parasites away. Oh, here's another one. That is awesome! <laughs> I just touched the stingray nice and gently with my two fingers on its back. Whoa, okay, let's, uh, let's touch another one. Oh, here's one right over here. Oh, oh hey. Whoa, oh, that's silly. Ooh, come over here. Whoa, there's so many of them. Whoa. Look at that one, it's just resting on the ground. That's a different kind. Huh. Oh, here comes one. Whoa! Hey, I'll describe what it feels like. It kind of feels, oh, here's one more. Whoa! Yeah, I really know what it feels like now. It feels like a wet gummy bear. <laughs> oh, so slippery and soft at the same time, but firm as well. Wow, <laughs> this is fun. Whoa! Oh, hey! Hey, Blippi, what are you doing? Oh, just sitting here looking at my favorite fish, the paddlefish. Ooh, paddlefish? That's pretty cool. It is. Well, see you later. Hope oh, see you later, Blippi. This is pretty cool being behind the scenes of the aquarium. Hello. <laughs> this is awesome. Whoa. Oh, hey. So many cool workers here. Whoa. Look at this. We're on top of an aquarium. Whoa. Look at all that water and those fish down there. Whoa. Okay. Follow me. Whoa. Look at this room. Whoa, there's so much scuba gear in here. Tanks, wetsuits. Whoa. Okay, we need to take this fish to the sharks. I bet they're really hungry. Come on. Whoa. Wow. Okay. Whoa, look at this. Whoever drew that is a good artist. It shows the different parts of a shark. Yeah, like the gills. Oh, 
<laughs> Whoa, look! All right, we did it! Here you go. Hi, thank you. Yeah. You're welcome. What's your name? My name's Danny. Ooh, this is Danny, and what are you doing here? So we're here with Cassie, and she's actually feeding our big sharks right now. Whoa, look, I see a fish down there. Look! Whoa, so what, why is she holding a fish on the pole? So that's how we get the food down to our sharks. If they're already low in the water column, she needs to be able to have a really long tool to get the food down to their mouth. Okay, so they hold the pole, which has a fish on the end, and then the sharks come up and have some supper. <laughs> Ooh, this looks like fun. Whoa, those fish look big. How big is that fish that she's feeding the sharks? Okay, that's a blue fish. That's about this big. So, what kind of fish did I bring up? So, you brought up some herring, which is a big fish in here. Okay. And then some caitlin, which is a little fish in here. Okay. Huh, interesting. Oh, hey, well, this is pretty cool seeing someone else do it, but hey, can I feed some sharks? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. okay. Just make sure you have your gloves on so the fish can be kind of stinky. <laughs> okay, all right. Let's put the gloves on so then my hands don't smell like fish for weeks. <laughs> okay, all right, I got my gloves on. Uh, oh, there we go. One glove, two gloves. All right, so now what do I do? So we'll just take this fish bucket that you brought up from our kitchen and we'll head over here. Okay, all right. Okay. We'll head over to our feeding platform. Okay. And as soon as we walk up, the fish will be all ready for us. Okay. Whoa! Look! I'm on the platform. Whoa, look! There's no barriers between me and the fish. Okay, I'm just gonna jump in. Oh, no. <laughs> just kidding. All right, here we go. Can I throw one at a time? Yeah, whatever you want. Either one at a time or all of it at once. All right. Enjoy this. Whee! Whoa, look at them go. They're really enjoying this food. Whoa, look at all of them. They're swarming to the top. Because they know that I'm throwing all this yummy food to them. like to eat? Greta loves lettuce, but she also enjoys cucumbers, bell peppers, and even sometimes carrots. Ooh, lettuce, bell peppers, cucumbers, and carrots? Sounds like Greta's really healthy. <laughs> Can I try feeding Greta? Yeah. Okay. All right. How do I do it? Just a little bit? Yeah, just a little bit. The whole leaf, you just pop it in front of her. There you go, Greta. Whoa. Hey, what are you doing? It's behind you. Should I throw another one? Oh, sure. Go. There we go. Sometimes you get them from me. Oh, okay. All right. Ooh, Greta's hungry. Here you go, Greta. Yum. Here you go. Oh. Greta is really big. 
Do you know how much Greta weighs? She is a little bit over 100 pounds. Oh, wow. 100 pounds. Wow. Oh, here you go. <laughs> okay, let's do a big piece. Let's watch Greta eat a whole piece. Here you go. It's a big piece of lettuce. Hello. Hey. Hello. Oh, come on. Since we just touched some animals, I think we should use this restroom and wash our hands. Let's go. Okay. Welcome to the bathroom. Whoa. Look. Whoa. This restroom is underwater. And this restroom actually won the best restroom in America. Whoa, you can wash your hands right here? And look at shark, sharks and fish. Whoa, this is awesome. <laughs> Pretty cool. All right, I wash my hands. Now I'll go dry them. You enjoy the view. on the escalator to the deep ocean. <laughs> Come on. Whoa, look. Now it's like we're underwater. Look this way. Oh, that's awesome. I present to you the Deep Ocean Exhibit. Hello. Hey. So this is a sea lion. Whoa. There's another one over here. Oh, it's so big. <laughs> so cool. Oh, look, look, look. Whoa, hello. <laughs> Whoa. And there's actually a seal in here as well. Let's go try and find it. Let's see. Oh, here it is. Hello. See that right here? This is a seal. Hi. So there's three sea lions in here and one seal. And the easiest way to tell the difference is this. I'll show you. So if you're a sea lion, you use your front flippers to basically walk like this. <laughs> but seals don't do that. Seals, oh, hello. Oh, oh you're curious, huh? <laughs> so curious. Whoa, so that's a sea lion. So it walks with its flippers. Hello, 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 hello. They're actually really smart animals. See how it's following me? I'll try and change directions. Whoa! <laughs> okay, and seals, they don't walk like that. You know, this is a sea lion. Sea lion. And a seal, they don't have that much power right here. And it's kind of short and stubby. So this is what they do. kind of waddle. <laughs> oh, that's silly. Wow, what magnificent creatures. Check them out a little bit more. Wow. 
Whoa. Penguins? Yeah. We're behind the scenes at the aquarium, and we're going to meet some penguins. Come on. Okay. Let's walk nice and slow, and we'll be very quiet as well. Ooh. Hey. Who are you? Hutch. Ooh, this is Hutch. Hey, and what do you do here? I work with the penguins. Ooh, the penguins and the reptiles. Oh, do you see the penguins back there? Oh, hello. Are these your only two penguins here? Oh, no, we have more friends that are coming. Would you like to grab a toy? We're actually going to play with them. Sure. Okay, let's grab a toy and let's see some more penguins. Look over there. They also can see colors really well and have rods and cones in their eyes just like we do. Okay. They're kind of, although they're birds, they're kind of acting like kitty cats, huh? Just a little bit. They do like to play with a lot of different types of toys. And just like kitty cats, they tell us when they want to be touched. Okay. Huh. Interesting. It's pretty cool. Hey, get a closer look. Oh, bye bye <laughs> <laughs> penguins are so silly. So where are these penguins from? These penguins are from South Africa. And hey. we have 32 of them here at the aquarium. Wow, 32 penguins here. And these are from South Africa? Yes. Not Antarctica? Not Antarctica. They're actually one of several species of penguins that prefer the warm climate. Oh, okay. That's pretty cool. Interesting. Warm climate and penguins. I guess you learn something every day. <laughs> hey, let's take a seat right over here. And then Hutch is gonna bring a penguin over. <laughs> I'm so excited. I get to touch a penguin. Ooh, hello. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna touch the penguin with two fingers gently on its back. Hey, okay. are you ready? So soft. Did you know penguins have 70 feathers per square inch? Yeah, they're really small and really dense. Can I touch the gam punch? Yes, you can. Okay. Does that feel good? You like that? She's showing off for you. What does that mean when she shakes her head? So that means she's really happy, uh, and you might be her new boyfriend. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> I hope she doesn't want a kiss. <laughs> oh, hello! This is a little blue penguin. <laughs> it's pretty small. Whoa! And this board has the sizes of different penguins. Oh, like the penguin I met today, an African penguin. Whoa, and they just keep getting bigger. Whoa, whoa, look how big they're getting. Whoa, look how big this penguin is. Whoa, four feet tall, 1.3 meters high. Jeez, look how big it is. Oh, whoa, that's a really big penguin. A toucan! <laughs> Do you see its beak? <laughs> kind of looks like the shape of a banana. A really colorful banana. <laughs> There's another bird over here. Come on! Whoa! Hello! <laughs> a colorful parrot! Hey! How are you? <laughs> Whoa! Looks like it's yellow, blue, 
and on its head is green. <laughs> hey! Hey, there's another animal right over here I want to show you. Come on! Whoa, look! Look at this animal! It's moving really slow. <laughs> Do you know what animal this is? Yeah, this is a sloth. Let's act like a sloth together. Hello! How are you? Ah! 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 <laughs> That's funny. All right, hello. These are otters, and they're so cute. Look at them go underwater. Whoa. I bet they can hold their breath for a really long time. Whoa, they're so fast. Whoa. <laughs> they kind of look like water cats, <laughs> but they're not kitty cats. <laughs> Whoa, hi. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> oh, another one. <laughs> cool! Whoa! That was so much fun learning about all these creatures at Odyssey in Scottsdale, Arizona with you. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Blippi, good job. All right, see you soon. <laughs>is a fire department helicopter toy. Ooh, and today, we're at the Los Angeles City Fire Department Air Operations. And let me tell you, I have a surprise for you.
Look at this! Look at this giant backpack! There's a bunch of medical supplies in here. Whoa! This is what they take down to the ground to help people. Whoa! Look at this light! Whoa! <laughs> it's the color blue and it's shining on my face. So these light, lights are really dim. So then from there you can use your MVGs, your night vision goggles, and see at night so it doesn't blind you. Whoa! Whoa! This is a headset. Wow, you put it on your ears. And then, has a microphone right here. But I have to plug it in first. Check this out. Get ready, listen. Whoa, can you hear me? <laughs> I sound funny. I'm talking through the microphone right now. Whoa, flying in a helicopter. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I'll, I'll show you more of that later. But for now, look at this. This, whoa, is a med deck. I can pull it out. It's nice and flat. Keeps the spine of the patient nice and flat. Okay, gotta put it back in here. Okay, there we go. Wow, it was so cool seeing the inside of the cap of the helicopter. Whoa, so many cool things. Whoa, what's this? Blippi, this is our hook for our rescue hoist. Oh, a hook on the rescue, wait, wait a second. Who are you? I'm Pilot Sharif. <laughs> what do you do? Well, today I'm the hoist operator on our air ambulance at the LAFD Air Operations. Ooh, that's cool. Wait, what's in your hand? This is called a pendant. It's what controls our hook. We can lower and raise it with this controller here. Whoa. This is the controller of the hoist. Wow, can you show me all of this stuff sure, in action? I sure can, would you like to try our, our hot seat? This is how we rescue people who really aren't hurt on the ground. In a hot, a hot seat? I wonder what a hot seat is. Well, our hot seat looks like a jacket. Go ahead and put your helmet on. Okay. And you already have safety glasses on, so yep. that works. <laughs> Look, I'm wearing a white helmet. This okay. works just like a jacket. And okay. it's a simple harness that allows us to bring you up into the helicopter safely Ooh. without falling through. Okay, so this is a harness that if I'm on the ground, you hoist down or someone hoists down to come save me, right? That's right. And they help you put this on just like this. Okay. And they'll connect you to the hook once you get down on the ground. Okay. They'll lower the hook down to you and then we'll connect it. Whoa. And when you're ready, we'll bring you up. Okay. Ready? I'm ready. Here we go. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> it's like I'm flying! We'll bring you all the way up to the helicopter. Okay. We'll bring you in, and then Blippi will be safe. Oh, cool! Fly away. Well, thank you so much for showing me this. Oh, you're welcome. All right. It's nice to meet you, Blippi. Nice to meet you, too. <laughs> wow, this is so much fun! <laughs> hey, wait! Hey, wait a second! Come back! I'm stuck! Helicopters are at airports and also airports.
airplanes are at airports. And if there's ever a problem at an airport, they have a big truck called a foam truck. Oh, hey, look, there's a foam truck right over there. Do you see it? Yeah. Okay, so what foam trucks do are they spray foam and water out the front just in case if there's ever anything at the airport, like a fire. So what we're going to do is show you it's spraying water out of the turret. See? There's the first turret. Whoa! That's so powerful. Are you ready for the second turn? All right, here we go. Whoa! You see that? There's one turret. big machine. Oh, hey, up here, this is the cockpit. This is where the pilot and the co-pilot sit. So then they fly the helicopter. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> and back here, this is the cab. Yeah, this is where all the passengers sit. And this helicopter is so big that 14 people can be inside here. 14? That is so many people. Whoa. Oh, look at this. This is a spotlight. Ready? <laughs> yeah, also known as the night sun. This is used to shine so then anyone can, everyone can see everything at night. Whoa, so bright. Ooh, and back here, these, this is a water tank, and you fill it up right here. Grab the hose. Bring on the water! 
then this fills up with water, and then from there you fly over things. <laughs> and then you pour water on things, like fires. So then you can save people. Wow, what a cool machine. Let's see what else there is, come on. Whoa, look down there. Wait a second, what's this doing here? Huh. You know how some helicopters have landing skids? This helicopter has wheels and tires. Wow, that is so interesting. Huh, cool. Ooh. Whoa, wait a second. You've seen this before, right? Yeah, this is a number. Yeah, one, two, three. The number three. Wow. Oh, let's open this up. Whoa. Check it out. That's a cargo compartment. It's pretty dark in there. <laughs> Come on. Oh, hey. Los Angeles Fire Department. Oh, they're pretty cool. <laughs> Ooh, wow, this is a horizontal stabilizer fin. It keeps the helicopter stable. Whoa, whoa, look up there. That's the tail rotor. Whoa, it's so high up there. And this, it looks pretty big, but in reality, that's the smaller rotor. But this one, the main rotor, come here. It is so big. You see it up there? Whoa. This main rotor has five blades. One, two, three, four, five. Good job. Whoa, it's so high up there. Anyways, I was just trying to touch it. <laughs> Whoa, look at this! The exhaust! <laughs> All the exhaust from the jet engine gets pushed out of there. Wait a second, I just said jet engine. Yeah, look! Whoa! That's the jet engine. There's two of them on this helicopter. One on this side and one on the other. This is where it produces all of its power. And one of the places that it uses its power is the transmission. Whoa, that is so cool looking up there. Oh, hey, look at this. You see right here? This is where you refuel the helicopter. We won't mess with that. Okay, let's see what else we have here. Ooh, <laughs> check out my sweet dance moves. <laughs> okay, anyways, look at this. This is the hoist. Whoa. It goes down. Yeah, about 300 feet roughly. <laughs> that is so much. So then it can save people by going. <laughs> Thanks so much for learning about the exterior parts of the helicopter with me. Now it's time for the firefighting helicopter song. It can fight forest fires from the sky. It can stop those flames from getting too high. It can save the trees. Save your home, it can even save your life. It's a firefighting helicopter, fighting fires from above the ground. A firefighting helicopter, on a mission to put those fires There's out. Lots of water when it flies, lakes and rivers are its water supply. Water from the sky. 
It's a firefighting helicopter Fighting fires from above the ground A firefighting helicopter On a mission to put those fires out A firefighting helicopter Fighting fires from above the ground A firefighting helicopter On a mission to put those fires out Learn about